Hi, so this is the Pistia Uderna adult. So I know that's a weird name, it's a species I came up with. It's the adult version of the dog species from the episode Simple. You may remember him, he was um, Pro Biddy's like, dog. Um, it's, it's an obscure episode. So this is, this is the guy. I think he's very cute. Um, so he actually has three different attacks that are chosen randomly. So I'll show them off now. Um, yeah, he's very dog-like in a lot of his animations. I love his walk. Here you'll see. <laughs> um, so this is the first attack where he kind of bites you a lot. And it's very easy to dodge away. Okay, yeah. So I'll get into that now. After you, he's attacked once, he'll back away, strafe once, and then try and suck you up. But you can dodge out of the way. And so I'll show that off now. Um, and also maybe a new attack. Let's see. Okay, it's the same attack, sorry. You can see he backs away and tries to suck you up, but he can dodge out of the way of that. Um, and, oh my god, same attack again? That's like a 1 in 27 chance. Is that a glitch on the FX? Uh, okay, yeah, no, new attack. So where he that's the one where he uses his claws and kind of slices you up. Um, let's see if we can get the third attack. Nope. <laughs> Same one again. All right. Uh, I'm gonna get out of the way. I'll turn to Heat Blast because he looks cool. Last attack. Nope. <laughs> Give me one second, guys. I'll fast forward this part. Oh, okay. There we got. Okay, so that one's the most interesting. He does a slash, but there's a very big break before um, he starts moving again where you can attack him. Um, yeah, yeah, here we go. You see, I can attack him during that time. Um, he's got a lot of very interesting attacks. I think I might need to improve this effect. It looked better when I was working on it, but it looks very unnatural. It's supposed to be, like, air coming into his mouth, but the strings are too long. Yeah, I'll fix that. Actually, now I'm gonna go make the arena, and before I do that, I'm just gonna fix that effect, and I'll be right back. Okay, so here we are. Uh, I made a little bit of an arena. I use some assets from Ravana. that's where they'll be featured. Um, I made these giant rocks because I thought they looked cool. Uh, as you can see, I'm on one. So there we have four enemies, and we're gonna fight them now. Um, I don't really know who to go for. I think Heat Blast, he's pretty standard. He also has a glide, so it'll be cool to go over there with. Alright, um, I'll start with you. Okay, yeah, I got their attention quick. If they're pretty hard to dodge their attacks, you have to be very- Oh gosh, they're shooting- Okay. Um, you really have to stay away from those attacks where they try and suck you up, because in the group they can be very dangerous. Um, that's a big thing that I kind of like about my game. Uh, enemies work differently when they're in groups. You have to, you have to like, think differently, because they have different things that can stack, uh, which I don't think a lot of games have. Okay, only one left. <laughs> Uh, I might have to buff their health. Um, I'll take him out in a cool way. Let's see, can I shoot him? Yeah, okay. Um, I'll, you know what? To make this more fun, I'll, I'll switch back to Ben. But I did lose a pretty good amount of health there, but I, I, I do need to um, make them more powerful. Probably just make them um, invulnerable during their attacks, like I, I talked about uh, the thing I'm going to do for most enemies. I think that'll make them a lot more powerful. Um, because I mainly attack them during their attacks. Okay, cool. So, that one's down. Um, so tell me how you think the fight went, if I should make them more powerful, and what I should do specifically. Um, I'm thinking I might have to buff their attacks, they weren't too strong. Um, or maybe just make them attack more often, like, uh, decrease the, um, amount of time in their strafe animation. Okay, so tell me your thoughts. I'm gonna go now.